Hello everyone, my sir Angie here, and rooks get plus one speed, so we'll see how that goes. I'm not sure exactly how dangerous that's going to be, because at the very least, I don't have to deal with the consequences of increasing rook speed immediately. Uh, I do want a green for a queen soul, so let's, yeah, let's do that. Sometimes folly shields will trigger if you shoot at an adjacent piece that's attacking you, and also attacking the square you recoil to. But sometimes they don't. I don't, I don't get it. Uh, you know, maybe, maybe the rooks being faster is a blessing, because... Um, because that means they get to me for the bonds promote. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't think this card is powerful enough to... Oh, add one fool. Is that just a jester that gives me an extra turn when I shoot him? Huh. This might give me a lot of extra turns. Probably not that many, though. Bishop plus one speed. No, thank you. Um, I mean, Enchanted Tiara seems like the obvious choice. I just have to say on dark squares. It's like, extra range is pretty good. It's the thing I need with this gun. Oh, right. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, I was like, why is my fire arc so big? Like, one second after they're just talking about how I have this card that makes me want to stay off of white squares. Oh, look, it's the... Wow, these are both really strong choices. So I get an extra turn when I kill a queen. I could also get an extra turn when I kill a bishop. Um... Taunting Hop is really good, though. I think I'm gonna take it. Alright, I actually stayed on the on the correct color square. Amazing. This never happens. Okay. Yeah, hopefully I can take out this pawn. I should, I should. What do I mean, hopefully? At two health, of course I was going to take it out. Oh! <laughs> the extra turn meant I didn't recharge my taunting hop. Um, I want to keep my queen soul, but I think it's safer if I just use it right now. Ah, uh, thank goodness for soul cards. I should really try to stay away from... Well... It's harder to use Taunting Hop if I'm, like, one space away from an edge, and then a piece attacks me by moving to the edge. But I guess I should keep that in mind. Try not to... Try not to have that happen. Alright, what am I... I can just shoot the thing and it's over. Okay, do I want a rat or do I want steady aim? This is an. Okay, do I want a rat or 10 extra degrees worth of accuracy? I think. Or do I want the moat? Hmm. Yo, let's try the moat. I want to move closer. Yeah, I want to be in range to just... I, I, I moved... To, I taunting hopped... Or I soul carded to a white square. Totally forgot. <laughs> it's super easy to forget how... <laughs> how karma works. Um... Okay. Okay. 
You know, we can just end the round right now? We sure can. Um. Hmm. Okay, if there's ever a time to take Searing Aura, I feel like it's this build. Because I have Taunting Hop, I have the Moat, and I think adding a Queen is like the best that adding a Queen is going to get. I have enough Fire Range, even with the Searing Aura, I think. I don't know, I just want, I just want to take the card. Oh, it, it triggers after the enemy turn, which is, I don't know, I guess, I don't know whether that's good or bad. Probably, probably bad. I don't know. Anyway, do I want to? I could, I could infiltrate the enemy side of the board onto this square. Yeah, you know, let's do it. Going, in. going in. Okay, taunting a hop right now is not the thing I want to use. All right, let's go. This is extremely irresponsible, what I'm doing. It's like jumping into enemy lines, like, oh, I hope it's fine. Anyway. Yeah, if I shoot this rook, then I'm gonna get discovered checked. Okay. Let's get back to the correct side of the board. Um, okay, I want to go to a light square so the bishop can't attack me. But I also want to go to a square where the queen's going to approach right next to me, which I think is just not possible. I don't know, let's go right here, see what happens. Alright. Another extra turn, let's go. I didn't really get any use out of that extra turn. Um... I went... I went the wrong... to the wrong square. Um... okay. Wait. So, all of these pieces are moving in two turns. Okay, that's kind of a lot of pieces. Okay. Well, the great thing is I get an extra turn when I shoot down this queen. Or I can just waste my rook soul so that I can get a soul card. Alright. This should be like a guarantee. I want at least one queen. Oh, the fiery aura, the fiery aura triggering at the end of the enemy turn is good because that means I can't get discovered checked by the fiery aura. That would that would be a very frustrating experience. Alright. I think I can afford it. Yeah, there we go. Well, I had a chance to take Lorraine the Clever earlier and I didn't. I could just take Lorraine the Clever now. I think Martyr... I think Martyr is fine. Revolution is potentially dangerous. I want Pawns to be slow. Commander is annoying. Yeah, I'll take Lorraine the Clever. It'll synergize nicely with my Searing Aura. Alright, get out of here. Yeah, my... My rat, my searing aura, my taunting hop. There's having all these sources of small amounts of damage. They they really add up. Alright, well I want a queen soul, so let's go get a queen soul. Just like that. Oh, I didn't need to worry about it. Didn't need to worry about dying on the turn I killed a queen, because I got that extra turn. 
Um, okay. Wow, two extra turns. Oh, I actually did get two extra turns out of that. I was like, oh, I got two extra turns on the same turn, but one of them triggered before the enemy turn and the other triggered after the enemy turn. <laughs> wow, another taunting hop. It would be pretty funny if, if you could use taunting hop twice if you in one turn if you had two taunting hop cards. Okay, well, I'm taking the extra, the extra barrel, it's really good. And I don't think the, I don't think the battle of attrition is going to be that dangerous. I think by the time the reinforcements roll in, I'll have taken out almost everything. I've taken out enough pieces where I'm not scared. Let's go regenerate some ammo. Alright. Yeah, let's just regenerate some more ammo. <laughs> I, just, I just laugh every time a queen promotes into a queen. Oh, the other bishop was at one health. Okay, the, the extra barrel doesn't hasn't doesn't seem to have been that impactful so far. That's okay. Wait a sec, can I just can I just like walk up to the king and shoot him? Mm, I don't know if I can do that. I want to shoot this rook without moving, but I can't. Alright, one more shot, and it's over. Good job, team. Didn't even hit turn 30. Okay. Bodyguard is actually kind of a nothing card because of how quickly all the knights die. Um, I could take Knight Bane and Righteous Wrath. I don't like having any blade because it just makes it so instead of shooting I have to use my blade. But I think it's still Nightbane is still good. No, this this is four blade. It's actually pretty good in this mod. Cannon fodder is just kind of annoying. It's like I want to get a peace soul and then I end up getting a pawn soul instead. I don't know. I think these are both just these are both pretty tame picks. I'll just take I'll just take the Nightbane. They're both very tame. It's just whichever one you like better. Alright, we have the... Alright, let's just take another shot, see what happens. Four damage. That's as much damage as my sword does. Wow. <laughs> don't get to... don't get to burn anything this turn. That's alright. Oh, I, I did. Okay, we got our queen soul. Yeah, it's like so much better to kill something with taunting hop or searing ore than it is to kill something with blade. Alright. Oh, I, I misclicked. Oh no. Oh, okay, we're fine. Oh yeah, we even get an extra turn, we shoot this queen. Give me that extra turn. And we even get another queen. Wow. Uh, I have 100% knockback, I'm pretty confident. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> just, just me betting my life because I don't want to have to use up my queen soul. No biggie. Well, I could double down on the whole, like, go to black squares build. Defensive formation. 
That's interesting. I think with the amount, with the, I have so many sources of small amounts of damage that I actually think this pawns ignore damage once is going to be kind of a non-issue. Bad rumors with all of the cards that I have that nerf queens like Enchanted Tiar and King's Mistress um, might actually be good. Oh yeah, and Subtle Poison. <laughs> These would be the weakest queens you've ever seen. Um, hmm. How much health do queens even have? I don't remember. If they have six health, then this will bring them. Oh, okay. I'll be able to just I'll be able to just kill a queen with my blade. Yeah, two health. Look at that. Not even gonna have to shoot her to kill her because just because of the. Uh, just because I have blade. Okay. Four more turns of poison. Alright. And I do get an extra turn off of this. I could flex by just shooting, just going right into the pawn's range. Actually, I am, I am going to do that. I'm going to flex by going right here. And then... Because it lets me use my taunting hop. No, I don't want to blade the queen. I want to shoot the queen. Uh, I wish I could just stand here. I wish I could just not take my turn and then the rook burns to death. <laughs> okay, this works though. Okay. It'll kill the queen and give me an extra turn. Just kidding. Alright, we finally done with the level. We're finally done with the level. That wasn't what the that wasn't so long. I don't know what I'm whining about. Um <laughs> Replace a queen with a queen. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take I'll take the ermine belt and the replace a queen with a queen. If there's any build to take Matryoshka doll, it's definitely this one. Uh, okay, I'm gonna just angle my shot in a way where I can't kill a rook or kill the pawn in front of the rook. This is still safe. All right, we flipped over the Matryoshka doll. Oh yeah, yeah, we get the regen on the edge of the board. Okay. Um, all right. Now I'll diagonally. Can we win before all the all the queens recover from being poisoned? You bet we can. And we got a queen soul again. <laughs> queen plus three health. Um <laughs> I think it's funny that Martyr just completely locks you out of the true ending. <laughs> This will give queens five health, which is still not very much. I'll take it. Big Game Hunter is such a powerful card. Okay, um, I gotta knock myself upward, or downward. Knock the knight. They're... I don't even remember what pieces were on the board. That's how fast I'm playing. Why'd I shoot that? Could have just blazed it. 
Oh. All right, just yeah, yeah. These queens are almost dead. There we go. We got a queen soul. We might actually get the turn 30 reinforcements. This pace. Oh, it's gonna be close. Come on. Yes, we ended it just in time. And, oh, the game really had to start me on a light square. <laughs> the moat really is such a fun card to have because of the peace of mind it gives me. In terms of just getting discovered checked. Um, sadly, the fiery aura does not protect me from getting checkmated on the same turn. Alright, and that big ermine belt value. Belt value. Whatever. I got a lot of bullets from my ermine belt. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's there's Bishop Castle and there's Queen Castle. Whoop, okay, I got it. Um let's regenerate some ammo and also get on, get on the correct color square. Oh the fiery aura did two damage to hit two tiles. That poor bishop, born just to immediately sacrifice itself to protect the king. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. Wow, we actually almost got checkmated by this. Um, okay, well, let's get to the other side of the board, I guess. Um. I gotta, I gotta... Uh, let's... Hmm. Uh... Yeah, I don't know, this is concerning. Wait, what are all the knights gonna do? Am I gonna be checkmated in a moment? Just might. Even with Taunting Hop, it's going to be hard to use Taunting Hop to get out of this one next turn. I don't know, there's... Oh, okay, it's fine. The knight move this way. Yeah, now I have a knight soul. And we can just walk here. Okay, we dealt with all the turn 30 reinforcements. Thank goodness. Oh, I thought we were done, but yeah, I get a queen every 15 turns. But I get an extra turn when whenever I shoot a queen, so it's all good. Not that it mattered anyway. But yeah, that's rank 24. Okay, same ending. Let's just see what rank 25 is. Plus two ammo max and king plus one speed. Okay, so we get a buff. And the enemy side also gets a buff, but it's not really a buff. Because if the king just moves closer to me, then he just gets shot. So, yeah, I think this will be easier than rank 24. But we'll find out next time. Until then, thanks for watching.